You're watching WEZT News at 11. You know, not a newscast goes by that we don't tell you about someone being charged, arrested, or convicted. I mean, we did right before the commercial break. And oftentimes, well, most times, we don't hear from them once they go to jail or go to prison. Well, WECT's Craig Reck introduces us to a couple of inmates who are making the most of their rehabilitation. Possession of marijuana, attempt to sell and distribute. Kill all the bacteria. I'm locked up for trafficking a firearm, and I'm facing a substantial amount of time. Take the brush, clean them off real good. This is a trash bag. We, we got to make good of what we got. <laughs> I try to maintain no time to complain, you know? <laughs> That's because these barbers are behind bars, tightening hairlines with their talents. Yeah, it was a gift that you know I always knew I had. But once you got the gift, it's really basically an art, you know? But you got to hold a clip with perfection, you know? That's right. This right here is a sharp line that I'm making right here, you know? On the streets, we would call this an ice pick. But even the gift needs some practice. A lot of training. Uh, dealing with different hairs and different types of hairs, you know. Well, I go to court too, look presentable when I go. Hope I get some good news. I wouldn't trust my hair with anybody else. If I ask him to fade, he'll fade. If I want it low and tight, he'll keep it low and tight. Jamie's my man. And Jamie feels the same about his repeat customers. Jamie's 18-year sentence means a lot of haircuts. I can take this and I can live here. I can get a suit from, you know, a couple of inmates and make it through the week. But payment is optional. Some people just don't have it, so, you know, we do it off the scrimp of our heart. Though not everyone's happy with their new hair. You do have some people that complain sometimes about the way they want their hair cut. But at the same time, customers are always right, even though we ain't fans, so we gotta live like we, we on the street, you know? Because that's where they plan to be one day. It's something that I'm gonna do when I do get out there and get my life together, you know? Craig Reck, WECT News. Uh, if you're wondering about safety now, any inmate in general housing in the prison can check out the Clippers just like they would a pen to maybe write a letter to someone they know. But now just Clippers, just Clippers, scissors are not allowed.